Good morning. Good morning. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls who are glued. At first, I'm not good at English. This is my first presentation in English. I try best. <laughs> Man, just reading a note. <laughs> well, let's start the presentation. Today's theme is the making of 80s Japanese game. I explain how was created about Zebius, Zebius, Zebius. I said Zebius, Zebius, and the Tower of Draga. Draga, uh, in the beginning, introducing myself. I was born in 1989. Yeah, go inside. 59. <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> uh, I was studied the photographic technology at the university. I immediate, immediately entered Namco after graduating and started to develop video games. Zebius was my first work. Recently, my research is the establishment of a new Japanese game design based on Japanese players' behavior. And this is today's agenda. The first half is about Zebius, and second half is about the Draga. And Zebius is a vertical scroll shooter arcade game that was released 1982 by Namco. I was in charge of the program, pixel graphics, and game design. I'll introduce in video first. Game start. And Zappa destroy against the air target. Also blaster destroy land target. Bacula looks like iron plate could not destroy. Floating fortress, named under Genesis, can stop the blast in the center core. Mysterious grief. It is friend. This is a Garza card, fired homing bullet. There are hidden target called Sol. Container of the created world. This section I talk about the background of development and the hardware architecture. This is Zebia's PC board. It mounted triple Z80A CPU and surpass the performance of personal computers. And Zebius is proposed game from marketing. There has been a lot of shooters since Space Invaders, for example, Galaxian, Galaga, and so on. And also the many scrolling shooters had appeared, for example, Konami's Scramble, uh, Sega's Zaxxon, Data East uh, Mission X, and so on. And the, the basic game design was determined before I joined the project. There was scroll map, separate two weapons for air and land, move on eight direction. These were standard gimmicks in the scroll shooters. And this is the first concept visual sheet. Vertical screen and vertical scroll. My ship is a jet fighter. Lower centered. 
Um, my shape is just trying to move in the dotted line area only. Zero one. Grip type lever to press the button, button, button with thumb. Head control handle looks like the throttle lever of aircraft. There was a raising and lowering function, but was not implemented finally. The bomb button is independent. Lower left image is the cover of prototype specification file. Zevius was 10th video game prototype in Namco, then called V10 before naming. The provisional title was Cheyenne, meaning the clan name of Native American. Why? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Light image is roll shaped map. Center image is the screen. The mind ship changed from jet fighter to helicopter because to set lower the scroll speed. The aim sprite was added for bombing easily. Um, graphic board has been designed according to the specifications. Each the RGB bit depth is 4 bit. The Namco video game graphic board has the unbalanced 8 color bit depth before Xevious. It was 3 bit 4 red and green color depths each, 2 bit 4 blue color depths. New graphic board has a balanced 12 color bit depths, then Xavius was able to use the neutral gray graduation later. Map at a large date. The width is over 4 times of screen size. Map use the data to cut out at any position. HB flip feature, uh, horizontal and vertical flip, uh, reduced the amount of graphic data and was most useful of animation. And this was the graphic data for prototype one. Prototype 1 uh, nearly equal alpha version. At this point, the theme was a modern warfare such as the Vietnam War. The jet fighter image at lower center is Fighter 4 Phantom. Also, the Phantom data remained on the retail version that displayed by the program back in play, and it became the hot topics like Phantom was appeared in Zebias. <laughs> we are troubled, really. <laughs> Application of animation technique. This section, I talk about the animation techniques that was used to Zebias. This image is the real-scale Gundam model. Uh, this is uh, 18 meters height. Uh, model is currently standing in Odaiba, Tokyo. I was an animation fan, and I like especially the Tomino Yoshiyuki works. For example, Mobi Suits Gundam, Space Runaway Ideon, and Aura Batra Danbai. Because the setting of the world is very fine and real. I thought I set the world finely in my own work. I tested some animation techniques. This is a rendering test for Banking's airplane at turning. It inspired by TV animation Battle of, the Battle of the Planet, 
Japanese title was Kagaku Ninja Tai Gachaman. <laughs> Means the science ninja team. I had a copy of the weapon that was thrown by the Gachaman leader named Ken. Span the pew. <laughs> and graphics that was a uh, graphic test was successful, but I recognized that the calculation of acceleration needed to achieve smooth motion. It is Zebia's first CPU software architecture. The first CPU was in charge of the main game routine. The second CPU was in charge of the enemy control and the map rendering. The third CPU was charged on the sound driving yesterday explains by Mrs. Ozawa. And the first CPU has a virtual multitask routine like the game engine. It has implemented mechanism to stabilize operating at 50 FPS frame rate on the triple CPU system. Of course, the acceleration routine was also implemented. Uh, this is an animation technique for pictures circulation. This method will be used to represent the circulated animation and the same pattern continuing animation. The animation change from the first image until the fourth image and the image corresponding to the fifth image is same as the first image. A moving object animation is easy to do by this method. By successful in this test, we decided to animate the enemies. Uh, I love also Star Wars. The Empire Strikes Back was first run in 1980. 80 Snow Walker appeared there and that was uh, one of my favorite machines. Also, multi-direct machine was appeared in Dagram, the Japanese TV animation. Left image is the Snow Walker in Star Wars, and center image is six-legged machine named Desert Gunner in Diagram. I tried their walking animation. Lower left image are four legs machine animation pattern. The circulation animation is different 180 degrees in the left and right part. Then I combine the left and right part to one image. Four pattern animation could express by two pattern data and their horizontal flipping. It looks working exactly. And ray tracing by hand rendering. This section I talk about the brightness effect and enemy graphics. In the early 80s, the ray tracing method has been known in CG designers. Computer processing power is low and could not render in real time by ray tracing. Ray tracing CG movie was done by pre-rendering. I thought the ray tracing CD could do in small pixel graphics by hand rendering. Next, I try 8 pictures circulation animation. Uh, I tested uh, cuboid, 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 cuboid. And rotation, but did not look to rotate by perspective effect only. Uh, it looks only 
as the shape changed, not rotating. I focus only two face was seen in front of the cuboid. Uh, I thought the surface brightness change was expressed the surface direction change. It looks rotated. Also, exactly. Uh, this sprite, uh, the sprite character before Zebias had been expressed in the colors and shapes. Because the number of color was three, maybe. Zebias sprite has eight colors, including transparent. Six colors had assigned to neutral gray gradient. The gradation of colors was not so many, but looks three-dimensional. White was used in highlight. It felt the specular because the highlight dif- uh, because the brightness difference between the white and light gray was great. It gave the impression the metal m- material is a metal. Zebias <coughs> had changed in the special presence. I love science, science fiction movies. It influenced from many works. The model of Zoshi was UFO. Uh, in 1970, British TV SFCs, UFO presented by AP Films, and also by Pictures. AP Film is a famous production in Super Mario Nation, such as International Rescue Thunderbird. The model of Terrace was Cylon Raider. Uh, in 1970, uh, 1978, American SFTV sheets, Battleship Galactica. Terrage was also called the Horseshoe Club by the project members. The model of copy was Millennium Falcon in Star Wars. It was also used to my ship as hovercraft in the second prototype, P2, nearly called Beta Bajo. The aim for bombing could use three colors. I implemented it was blinking when it was overlay the enemy. It becomes possible to find the invisible enemy. I implemented invisible target while angry boss. He said, there is no sense of acceleration in the invisible target. It is a shooter. But so many testers felt the invisible target was a lot of fun, then it was become okay. <laughs> the light animated image is hidden target, so it was called bamboo shoot by the testers. The play of looking for soul was called as bamboo shooter digging. Special flag was Larry X gimmick. Oh, you don't hang. Uh, 
And this target was sense of incongruity. I implemented it for extra my shape. It appears at the position where the my shape is absent. The aim was not blinking on this target. Special flag, special flag was become the first mystery of Zivias. And civilization is based on language. This section, I talk about the creation of Zivias world. This image is a power page of Ide in the Japanese TV animation Space Runaway Ideon. In Ideon, there was a lot of uh, ingenuities in order to express the culture of aliens. I was going to express the culture of the enemy in Zivias. Uh, the title, Zivias, was determined by Mr. Iwatani. That has been secret. <laughs> he was the boss of the planning section in Namco. He said, Zivias is a cool word, just like Mebius. <laughs> I thought, huh? <laughs> What are you saying? <laughs> Doing. <laughs> also, he said, the word including gagigugego, zajizdezo, dajizdedo, babibubebo sound was felt very strong. For example, diga, legza, zerubis, gigantes, is strong. In Frankfurt Airport, there was an Hermes shop, opposite side of a Bulgari shop. Under the Iwatani method, Bulgari is stronger than Zivius, uh, stronger than Hermes. Of course, I think so, without their prices. Uh, light image is a geograph in Zivius. Initially, this area was just a plain. But because it was too flat plain, the map designer added a geograph as an accent. Mr. Iwatani said with delight, It's wonderful, mysterious feelings! I was prepared to have to go with this policy, mysterious feelings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> the game must be well moderated. This is a policy for shooter in Namco. The large forest was necessary, but it is difficult to display large fortress and by hardware performance was too low. The designer had proposed an octagonal design fortress because the round design fortress of the prototype had a not no noticeable, noticeable jaggy that three dimensions and that three dimensions fortress have been implemented beyond the limit of the hardware performance. Then the barret is not occasionally displayed. However, many people did not notice it, it was no problem. And released. Uh, in order to build a world view of the game, I thought a lot of things. Who was the invader? Where did the enemy come from? Why did they come? 
What are the geography? What mean Zebius? Someone said, just a game. But I consider the justice for player and enemy each. The answer of these questions were becomes a narrative. At the time, I did not the word narrative, of course. And the story of Zebias was sought under referring the idiom. The, the, idiom. the theme of the idiom was combat between the Earthling and the alien named Buff Clan. The Earthling and Buff Clan have the same ancestor. The enemy of Zebias was the ancient Earthlings. They was immigrated to the space at the space and come back. The ancestor left the ruin in the Ideon. Also the geography in Zebias was a lyric that means the return of the ancient earthling from space in future. Future. After all, I determined what Zebias means the fourth star. In fact, Zebias was the fourth planet of the six planets that was the immigrate destination of the ancient Earthling. And there was a trend on the name of the weapons of Buff Clan. And the name of the same type of weapon had the same end part. For example, spaceship named has a Zan. Cruiser name, Gramzan, Girozan. Carrier name, Gatamanzan, Gadomazan, Kimazan. Battleship name, Dorwazan, Garwazan, Sadisan, Gabrozan. And robot name had Mac. Jigmak, Dogmak, Logmak, Gidomak. And fighter name has a bar. Not road. Deck bar, Gil bar, Gond bar. And the names, uh, the names of enemy in Zebias was sought by uh, line, 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 lineage. 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 Hmm. And we are configured basic word to naming enemies. For example, number zero through fifteen were Zop, A, Shio, Ori, Zebi, Lef, Fa, Sopia, Gau, Luk, Pasto, Pik, Bio, Fes, Solita, Kurt. Of course, I also do not remember, just reading. <laughs> and devious naming rule was made. For example, Garu means big, then large version of enemy name half was Gar. A uh, head, head was Gar. Derota, large version, named was Gar Derota. Baras, large version, named was Gar Bara. The, the every buff crown weapons has a part of the same pattern. That was black based red polka dot. And I thought better that the enemy of Xavius has the same symbol, but pixels is not enough. So I did put a red blinking part to all of the enemies in Xavius. The blinking timing of all enemies was synchronized. Because programming was easy by this way. (laughs) 
Fortunately, someone said, I feel the enemy intention. It was a great success by cutting corners. <laughs> Now I think that was a good narrative. Realized、um, by non realistic sound. This se- section I talk about the sound of Xevious.、Uh, the sound staff of Xevious was studying the g a m l a music at university. Around this time, the person who has received professional education of music was started to im- Involved the game department,、uh, development. Music was t e n d to become the important part of the games. Uh, Namco had its own programmable sound generator circuit without using Texas Instrument ICT chips. It has a 4 bit waveform data. But it has three voices and one note channel only.、And、the sound driver was implemented on the third CPU program. The sound staff entered Namco at the same time with me, then we were consulted each other anytime. Our conclusion the game music did not need. To be able to play in human performance. Our concept was counteracting the misery of combat by music. We were used simple refrain the style is a minimal music. The hit sound was felt to break, was not felt to kill. The bombing sound is a simple portament. Pew! Portament.、And、the explosion sound of the ground attack was only realistic. The music of Zebius was an opportunity. For the first release of game music soundtracks. The impressive sound effect was the attack invalid sound of b a c u l a r I was also a keyboard player. And had been owned an analog synthesizer. This metallic sound creates like using the ring modulator. The expert Zebius player was shooting rhythmically like playing instrument by this sound. <sighs> Realization of dilution in the brain. Uh, this section, I talk about the other topics. d e v i o u s was a realization of the world in my brain. Exactly, it was c h u n i b y o I was happy to make d e v i o u s in my first career.、And、using the Atari font data was common in Namco games. There were some font data to read easy by computer, light image as an example of that.、Uh, upper image is the countdown, and lower is data 70. Xavier's font data was designed from countdown font,、uh, center image is it. Left image, Panzer. Was a pet name, the title of prototype to pet name. This name is derived from the、uh, Panzerkampfwagen of German because I liked Panzer tank and Rommel tank of Germany 
It's cool. <laughs> of course, I made the Tamiya's plastic model of these tanks. Uh, I did not like the title name Zibias because it was no meaning word at first. I thought the Spain to give the cool impression it was not bad. The first letter changed to the X. I requested the metallic prototype to the designer. Upper right images is the part of candidate designs. Uh, it was pointed out from the Zebias fan recently uh, that the three characters of center looks like V10, the code name of prototype. The fan believes it was my work, but I know it was an accident. Game characters will be the cool illustration for public relations. Left illustration was drawn by the designer of development section. And right illustration was drawn by the designer of design section. Left graphic was pre-release version, but right illustration was better than the left illustration. They, I changed the light graphics. It has been we reproduced. Of course, I do. I wrote a story about why the enemy was attacking. I wrote it on note in 1982, and that was published in 1991. Lower light image is a Xebius flyer. Top part, top part. Uh, the sentence in AD 2012 from the story of Father Out was printed at the top of the flyer in red, red X marking part. Um, cause I was so young. Everyone do not understand what it means. Um, the devious world was lived by, loved by many fans, and the various derivative works are made. Left image is the arcade game Solvaru. Center image is PlayStation game Xebias 3D Z Plus. Upper right image is a plastic model Solvaru Maship. And lower right image is a music record Super Xebias. There are many other. Next half. And the Tower of Draga is an action adventure arcade game that was released in 1984 by Namco. I was in charge of the game design and pixel graphics design. I in introducing in video. Start tonight. Game start. Attacking enemy monster. Get the torture chest. Pick up the keys to open the door. And the next floor, then level is cleared. Magic spell blocked by sealed.
Dragon Blessing. It is a illusion. At last, defeat Trovac. Integrated three roads and rescued the Maiden Kai. Congratulations and game over. Uh, encounter with role playing. This section I talk about the my role playing game experience. This image is a scene in the movie E.T. They play Dungeons and Dragons. I was reading a book of E.T. before watching the movie. I could not understand T and D by reading book. I could not understand still D and D by watching the movie. <laughs> I purchased the package of D and D in US, but gave up to play. Because you know, the rule was written in English only. <laughs> I understood RPG by wizardry. I purchased Apple II computer and played wizardry through the night two or three days in the weeks. I was still young. <laughs> As a side, in 1987, we translated wizardry to Nintendo Entertainment System. I received the most strong influence from this game. I felt the possibility of the action RPG and was started to make prototype. The Return of Easter prototype. This section I talk about the prototype making before the Tower of Draga project. This image is the title on the cover of specification. The same name of game released in 1986, but this was the prototype version. I had played the trumpet as a junior high school student, and we were playing the overture. This overture. I remember the goddess Easter to use as a scene. Left image is Easter of D and D booklet. Right image is the Easter gate at Iraq. I determined the game story based on Babylonian myths and the Old Testament. Uh, the another motif was Tower of Babel. Left image is the comics Babel's second. It's area who crash landed on Earth, built the Tower of Babel with super technology. The descendant boy defends the tower using his ESP. Extrasensory perception. And center image is a picture, Tower of Babel, painted by. Uh, Peter Brugels. Peter Brugels. Peter Brugel. It is a very tall building that reaches the crowd. Light image is the Tower of Tarot Card. The Tower of Drug game was inspired by the Babelize episode. Uh, 
And this graffiti is a note of when I was thinking the world setting. Uh, uh, the tower, uh, shining road, uh, shadow of the tower, another world, another time. Uh, many elements of the story were written in this paper. In fact, it's the back of the flyer. This memo was written at Ikebukuro, Tokyo. In this time, there was the highest building in Japan, the building named Sunshine City, that was, uh, that have 60 floors. I thought climbing this building to walk was very hard. <laughs> then I came up with a 50th floor building climbing on foot, the Tower of Draga was 60 floors high from this reason. And this is the specification of prototype the return of Easter. <coughs> Unfortunately, this game was too time consuming. It was the second episode of the three episodes in this story. I was determined to try to make the episode one game in a different form. Um, definition of the maze element of the action. This section I talk about the maze and the new game concept. This is a maze escape robot, Mappy, designed by Zebius graphic designer. Namco had also promoting uh, the robot business. This robot was programmed by the Ace Video Game Programmer. The arcade game, video game Mappy was developed based on this robot. The Tower of Draga project proposed the reuse of the surplus Mappy PC board. It calls V14B, was meaning V40. Mappies, another version. You know, under the Iwatani method, drug, drug was stronger than Mappy, exactly. <laughs> it's a just joke. And then it renamed to V25 later. And the maze has only one route from the point to other point. This type maze can solve by the light method. A light method is also referred to the light hand rule. For more details, such on maze light. Strictly, Pac-Man map is not a maze. I was determined the new game map structure will be the maze can solve by light method. Then the game concept was the maze solving action. This image is a project plan. The title was the defense or at Tower of Anu. 
Um, the game was level clear type. Get the key to exit the door. The enemy does not defeat is appeared at time is over. Generally, it's called Gosenzo Sama in Namco. Uh, we determined to pop and cute character design because the maze was dark image. And this black and white illustration quoted from the D and T booklet. The color illustrations were designed for this game. And the many things were long. The plate armor should not be in Babylonian absolutely. Give looks like a Greek gladiator. Dorwaga looks like Durga of Hindu mythology. Maiden Kai was popular because the first miniscat character in the games. Palette Magic Character Data Coding. This section I talk about the pixel graphics and animations. This image is main character graphic data. Gear looks was changed when getting the new equipment by color change and transparent assign. The dragon breast graphic was changed shape depend on the wall structure. Big frame is white representation because the temperature is high. Dragon was divided four parts. Body, head, tail, and wings. The independent animation made the variation of animation. Walking as animated by body part only. Fire blessing signal was animated by wing parts flapping. Uh, I was aimed the ultimate frame animation using four patterns circulated animation. I watched to study movie Blade Runner Design the frame at first. Uh, the frame had different shapes depending on the size. The frame was different temperature depending on the part. Uh, where the temperature was high, color was bright. Finally, I reached this animation. I thought it was it's so good. Uh, using the four pattern circulated animation, the animation of tentacles had focus on bending, smooth moving such as a whip uh, is quite good. This monster is Lopa. Generally, the Lopa don't move. I did not that fact. The Lopa was moving in the Tower of Draga. The Japanese Lopa was able to move. Of course, it's wrong. I'm guilty. Uh, it was mystery why the variation was needed to choose. 16 carats from 16 carats. I thought the new technique from this strange feature. You know, the Tower of Draga PC board was same as Mappy. Mappy has not used color variation. New technique was 
change graphic shape using the different color code to same data. Center image is sprite graphic data. It can create the different shapes by assigning a color to each part and shown on light image. And left image is uh, the model of this night. Uh, blue night head looks like Jiong head. Uh, Jiong had mono eye, blue night had mono eye. Uh, this technique was called palette, palette magic afterward. Uh, the knight character was divided in three parts. This game controlled by four direction lever and one button. Press button, button to use the sword. Um, the both hand animated independently and the body part assigned walking animation. The shield was usually set in front of character and neutralize the flying spell uh, without using the sword. In using the sword, the shield was offset left side and neutralize the flying spell from left direction. The high skill level player was remain the sword in use and receive a spell uh, with a uh, shield by adjust the direction. It was an unbelievable technique. <laughs> Lower image are the player character's graphic variation. Left pattern is color coded data. Center pattern is a player character shape in low level. No phone, no helmet line, and no shield chevron pattern. Body line is brown. No gauntlet blue edge, no boot blue edge, no boot wings. Light pattern is a player character shape in top level. Mm, it It called blue gear um, by the expert players. Blue gear, but it's not a fish. Um, horns, blue line helmet, blue chevron pattern of the shield, blue body line, the blue edge in gauntlet and boots, and blue boots wings. The same data was used for the enemy knight. Upper image as a player character shape variation. Lower left is mirror knight. The base color is silver. The red lines, the red cross pattern of the shield. The shield pattern could change to chevron pattern or cross pattern. Only color coding. Of course, and they are the same data. Lower light is hyper night. Each color had two brightness. Helmet and shield were painted in two colors. It looks three-dimensional somewhat. Uh, implementation of Enigma. En Enigma. Mm. This session, I talk about the meta game for adventure and game community. This image is a communication node. Every arcade has a communication node for information exchange among the players. There was no internet. Um, Xavier's expert player 
were played six hours at one coin. <laughs> There was only four coins income per day. <laughs> If arcade opened 24 hours a day, that was a big trouble in arcade. I have felt the need to end quickly the gameplay. However, the player must be satisfied. A good example is the race games. The player will try as soon as possible to go. The more early go, the more early game over, but the more satisfaction can be obtained. This is the ideal mechanics design. I thought if the game had a story, a happy ending will be finished the game with a big satisfaction. Uh, the player could not play more than one hour games. It was a good idea. <laughs> 24 coins income. <laughs> And breaking through the maze only was so simple. I thought this game needs a motivation up feature. And the players requested me supplying the mysterious following Zebias. We implemented the Enigma. Sometimes, if the player do something, then the treasure chest comes out. And the condition of appearing in the treasure box was the enigma. For example, in Flow Fast, defeat three green slimes and get Kappa Matok to break the wall. Uh, in for a second, defeat two black slimes and get jet boots to increase walking speed. Walking, walking, walking speed. Eh? Uh, solving the enigma had been performed at each arcade. The regular of arcade wrote an、uh, information to the communication node. The enigma solving was become a race of arcade each other. Some player went to the scout in other arcade. The pioneer players were hiding the play screen with cardboard. <laughs> To hide their operations. They paid much money for this game. So many players said the board price was more cheap than coin play. <laughs> exactly.、And、this story called Babylonian Castle Saga. And many fans have loved this world. Upper images are my series works from Red, 1986 arcade game, The Return of Ishtar Action RPG. I was in charge of the game design and pixel graphics. And second, 1988 Family Computer, The Quest of Kai Action Games. I was also in charge of the game design and pixel graphics. And the third image 1984 Super Family Computer, The Blue Crystal Road. Episode name The Destiny of Gilgamesh. Multi story adventure game. My part was game design and graphics. And 
light image, uh, 2008, Windows PC, The Recovery of Babylon, MMORPG. Lower images are the derivative works from left. And 1986 game book, The Hero of the Temple. Second is the uh, um, 2000 Nintendo Game Boy and Doruru Aga, RPG game designed by Mr. Kishimoto. And 2004, PlayStation 2, The Nightmare of Draga, roguelikes game. And 2008, TV animation, The, Age, the Aegis of Work and The Sword of Work. I play voice in this animation, Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> and 2000. this music, yesterday afternoon keynote speaker, Mrs. Ozawa's first work in Namco. Good music, I thought. And I determined to use in the next new game in 1982. It was the first piece of the Tower of Draga project. Uh, the every Japanese game creators were making the game they want to create in 1980s. The Japanese game had been creating under the concept of uh, and concept oriented. Everybody Uh, let's replay. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>